Hi guys, good morning. Today, I'm gonna show you the common commercial species of aquatic resources. By the way, I am Liubert Gomez from Basic I2A at Second Year College in Surigao do Sur State University, Lianga Campus. Common commercial species of aquatic resources. The main purpose of the captured fisheries is to provide and sustain seafood's highly demanding market. In this lesson, is tackled about the common commercial species that being patronite of today's society. Constance, the feature and common local scientific name to determine the usually known aquatic resources. The content are from the trusted references in the Philippines and around the globe, such as Bureau of Fish and Aquatic Resources. The food and agriculture of the United Nations, per syllable, is most accurate information. The milkfish Chanus Chanus is the sole living species in the family Chanidae. However, there are at least five extinct genera from the Cretaceous. The species has many common names. The Hawaiian name for the fish is Awa and in Tahitian, it is Ava. It is called Bangus in the Philippines, where it is popularly known as the national fish, although the National Commission for Culture and the Arts has started that this is not the case as it has no basis in the Philippine law. Why Bangus is national fish? Well no, for its belly puppets abundance of bones, the Bangus are milk fish, regarded by many Filipinos is the country national fish. For hundreds of years, aqua farmers in Southeast Asia have been raising bangus in sea caves or fresh water ponds. Tilapia are mainly fresh water fish inhabited in shallow streams, ponds, rivers, and lakes, and less commonly found living in brackish water. Historically, they have been of major importance in artisanal fishing in Africa. And they are of increasing importance in aquaculture and aquaponics. Tilapia can become a problematic invasive species in new warm water habitats such as Australia, whether deliberately or accidentally introduced, but generally not in temperate climates due to their inability to survive in cold water. Tilapia are the second most important farm fishing in the Philippines ponds, cages, and fins. Brackish water ponds throughout of the country. Brace water ponds in Mindanao in marine coastal water cages are since to up a high potential for growth. Utinos apinis, damakeril tuna, little tuna, kawakawa, or tongkol is a species of pre pen bony fish in the family Scombridae or Mackerel family. It belongs to the tribe Tanini, better known as the Tunas. This is an Indo-Pacific species which is found from the Red Sea to Prince Polynesia. I have misunderstood this fish, I admit, that there was facilitating between two Philippine names, Tambacol and Tulingan, and the English name, Mackerel Tuna. The fish photograph here of Tulingan in different parts of the Philippines, either the mackerel tuna or the skiff of tuna are both referred to as tulingan. The walking catfish Clarias batricius is a species of freshwater air breathing catfish native to Southeast Asia. It is named for its ability to walk and wiggle across dry land to find food or suitable environments. While truly, it does not walk as most bipeds or quadrupeds do. It has the ability to use its pectoral pins to keep it upright as it makes a wiggling motion with snake-like movements to traverse land. This fish normally lives in slow-moving and often stagnant waters and ponds, swamps, streams, and rivers, as well as in flooded rice paddies or temporary pools that may dry up. When this happens, its walking skills allows the fish to move to other aquatic environments. Considerable taxonomic confusion surrounds this species and it has frequently been confused with other close relatives. 
One main distinction between the walking catfish and the native North American, a colored catfish with which it sometimes is confused, is that the walking catfish lacks an adipose pin. It is called catfish in English. Heto in Ilocos, heto in Pampanga, and Pantat in Pangasinan, Cebu and Iloilo. Catfish are usually found in marshes, rice fields, warm stream, river, lakes, irrigation, canals, or in any body of freeze water.